everyone. Welcome back to the show. We're here at New York Tech Day, checking out some of the hottest new companies on the market today. Let's take a closer look. So Social Passport goes ahead and allows users to walk by a window, tap their phone, and instantly be able to like, follow, and check in. But even better, we allow the merchants to do a quid pro quo where we say, how about for a deal for a post? We'll go ahead and we'll give you, let's say, a free topping at your local yogurt shop in exchange for this post. And now that merchant allows them, allows them to communicate their deal not only to you, but the, to their entire network of friends and family. When you're not using social media marketing, Social Passport also provides users with a couponing system, loyalty cards, and the ability to also find out deals near them where they can find out all kinds of specials and deals in their local area and also get rewarded for using their social media. Social Passport allows you to basically combine all your social media in one place and start getting rewarded for it. Visit socialpassport.net and download the app on either iPhone or Android. So we are the Hoot, and what we are is a short-term social planning service that allows our users to post within one to four categories what they want to do tonight. After they post, they can see what all of their friends have posted, and it circumvents having to call, wait on text messages, wait on group emails to figure out who wants to go to that movie, who wants to go to happy hour, who wants to stay in and watch the latest TV show on HBO. And uh, I guess that's about our 30-second pitch. Hello, I'm Steve Dietzik with Hoppit. Hoppit is the world's first ambient search engine for restaurants and bars, down to the nitty gritty. If you want a romantic place with a cozy vibe, with exposed brick and a fireplace, Hoppit will find the exact location for you in 25 cities in the US. New York was our base, and we launched there about last week, and we have 10,000 uniques in the first week. Thanks. Uh, so we're Newton, we're an online adaptive learning platform. Um, we provide tools for publishers, instructors, content creators, to uh, load their content onto our platform and provide adaptive learning experiences for their students. So the underlying Newton technology actually provides personalized learning paths for every single student on the system for whatever curriculum they happen to be working in. Hi, I'm Megan from Ideally. I'm Emily from Ideally. Um, Ideally is an online retailer. We focus on limited time, limited quantity sales of mainly women's designer fashion. We also sell menswear, kids wear, home goods, and luxury travel at up to 80% off of retail. We have 5 million members across the U.S. Um, and we've grown extremely rapidly since we were founded in 2007. Hi, I'm Brian Shields with Incubate NYC. We're the first technology and entrepreneurship incubator for Upper Manhattan. We've decided that because there are no workspaces for entrepreneurs who have great products and have uh, awesome companies to be located above 59th Street, we'd build one for you. So we're out here soliciting feedback and we hope that we can give you the product and development support we get from Google and Columbia and several of our other partners like Alston and Bird and Holtz, Rubenstein and Remnick. Thank you very much and we hope to incubate you hey, soon. We're Focus Lab and we are a SaaS-based tool that enables you to uh, essentially select people based on any attribute or any action you specify in real time. So think of it as user targeting for the rest of us. Napkin lets you create business cards on your phone, swap them quickly using QR codes, and then refer, get referred and refer other people and get notified right away. Hi, we're Delve. We're building a news curation tool for organizations. We're, uh, we're gathering a bunch of stories. We're helping teams curate it internally and share them across our organizations. Yeah, we allow people to provide uh, discussions around news content uh, that they would otherwise maybe have in their email. We bring it out of the email and put it in a web product that they can keep track of and organize throughout their organization. And right now, most of our users are either emailing stories around or they're using Google Reader. Um, and we found this really interesting solution that integrates all of this functionality in one place and allows them to share it into the secondary feed and then comment on it and vote stories up and down and really find the stories that are relevant to their organizations within their own teams. Hey there, my name is Dennis. I'm from Visual Revenue. We help publishers like the New York Daily News, Forbes, and InStyle decide what goes on their home page or section front page. So instead of going entirely by gut feel and Diet Coke, we can come up with a suggestion on what goes on the hero spot at this moment in time. And if you like it, you take it. And if you don't, we'll come up with a second best suggestion. Cheers. 
Hi, I'm Noshin Chaudhary, CTO of Spotless City. And what Spotless City does is seamless web for dry cleaning. We partner with local dry cleaners to help them connect with customers in a brand new way. So customers can log onto our website, see all the dry cleaners that deliver to their exact address, compare prices, compare services, select the dry cleaner they want, and then schedule their pickup and delivery at a time that is guaranteed to work for them. Um, so what we're trying to do is just you know, simplify dry cleaning. It's free for customers, and we want to make clean clothes just clicks away. So what it has to offer, uh, we're essentially eBay for Craigslist. Uh, we have the locality of Craigslist with local subdomains, uh, so newyork.hastooffer.com, and you can list and buy uh, auction items just like you would uh, local classifieds with the auction format. Hi, I'm Lindsay, uh, Director of Marketing for Spark Rebel. We are social curation meets e-commerce. When members log on, they can follow brands, uh, see specified streams of anything new, any new products they want. Um, they can also click through to purchase anything. We have over 3,000 brands on our site, which is really exciting. And uh, our members are able to get real-time updates, uh, notifications about what their Facebook friends are doing on the site, and also any updates from brands. So they have uh, uh, lots of chances to uh, find what they're looking for, in addition to also uh, curating um, any products, web, web finds, or blogs on the web. Hi, this is Vishal Gupta from Local Fave. Local Fave is a friend-to-friend -friend venue review service where you can log in, pull in your past check-ins, and we let you augment them with ratings. And as you augment them with ratings, we help you find your favorite places. So whether your favorite sushi place is in the East Village or if it's in Tokyo, it's important to not only you but your friends. So they, your friends can download the app, they can use the web service, and they can see where to go when they're in your neighborhood or wherever you've been in the past. It's a great way to experience the world through, through the eyes of your friends. Hey, I'm Alex Gutler. I run strategy and business development for Techstars New York. Techstars is a seed stage mentorship driven accelerator program for internet startups. Every nine months we run a program where we bring 14 or 12 of the best companies in the country. We take applications like a college and less than 1% of all companies that apply get in. When you actually come in, you get access to a network of about 150 mentors, about $120,000 worth of funding and expertise from our whole network that comes in and helps you build your company. Hi, I'm John Gottfried and I'm a developer evangelist for Twilio. So Twilio is a cloud communications platform. That means that we provide tools for developers to easily send and receive text messages and make and receive phone calls from a web or native mobile application. So an example is maybe you want to notify a uh, user when their order is ready at a restaurant. You could send that via SMS without them having to install an application. Uh, we're actually here today with two other companies that are powered by Twilio, uh, Amicus and Foundit. Foundit lets you anonymously return lost items that you found uh, via a phone number. And Amicus is a social fundraising platform. My name is Susan Nicholas. I'm the founder of Doc Ponds. Uh, we are a 21st century healthcare company. We have outpatient healthcare services at a discount. Anyone can register with us. It's free to register. We have 40 practice areas and outpatient medicine to choose from. You simply register on the website and a healthcare provider in your local area will send you a coupon directly to your inbox. You can purchase that. No insurance is required. And you simply uh, schedule your appointment just like any regular patient. So it's just a new way to access and consume U.S. healthcare, And everyone is eligible. Hey, uh, so I want to tell you a little bit about, about Appitude. Appitude is a social network for food that you can order from. What we want to do is answer the question is, uh, what's good to eat on a menu? So there's sites out there that let you order food, but they don't let you know what's good to eat, which is where we come in. How we do that is by turning a menu into a social menu consisting of dishes, I mean of comments, yums, and images of pictures, all to make your uh, ordering decision that much easier. And uh, we're currently in the NYU area right now, servicing East Village, West Village, and uh, Greenwich. We have 25 restaurants on our network and are in beta right now. So uh, Appitude is here for you to order. Whenever you're hungry, just come on. <laughs> we are fetch we're innovators of the digital business card. We actually make it really simple to trade information just like a business card. But we keep track of it for you and we don't require anyone to download any event. As you can see, New York Tech Day showcased the most innovative companies on the market today. This is Aaron Herman. Thank you for watching.